Hello 3D stopped shipping products to America and I would like to show you in this short video what workaround there might be. It's not tested but definitely worthwhile looking at to get products from Hello 3D as long as these two are fighting about taxes, import taxes, not shipping to whichever country. I really think it's worthwhile to have a look at the video. Maybe it will help you to finish your, your project, your 3D printing project. Maybe getting the spare parts that you need to get your printer back up and running so that your farm is operational. So please stay tuned and I hope this video will help you, will give you ideas how to get those products that you need into the United States. I posted the Mammoth 3D all-wheel drive um, on the VZBot uh, Facebook group this week. It came out this week, finally available for um, users to, to buy the kit. And um, members from or yeah, members from the from the United States um, gave me feedback that they cannot buy this product because Melo is not shipping this product to America. And um, I did reach out to, to Melo to find out what's going on. I haven't received feedback. And then I actually went tonight onto their website. I simulated that I'm in America and I started searching for products. And this is the only product that I could really find. And if I click on this product, then it really states that this product cannot be shipped to America and you don't find any products. So again, I don't know what's going on. And with this video, I am trying to see if we can find a temporary solution helping you to still be able to order your parts that you need from Melo, um, but with a little detour. I'll get into that. Just um, stay with me for another minute. So I then simulated that I'm in the United Kingdom and all the products are there. Like we know the Miller store. So the site is not broken. It's just blocked for America. So here is the Miller um, or the, the Mammoth 3D all-wheel drive um, out of CNC aluminium. All the different um, products are here. You can select it and buy it. I mean, that's as, as we know. So what I'm trying to show you, and this is something that I've done for, for many years, um, was I um, still use a company that's called myus.com. This is um, the, the main website. So if you have already an account, you can sign in. If you are new to the site, you can sign up and create an account. I created my account about seven or eight years ago with this company. I use this company if I uh, shop in America. Let's say I have an order from Fabrico. I have an order from West 3D, from um, Slice Engineering, any of the American companies. Um, if I would ship all of my individual orders to Switzerland, I have to pay, depending on weight, by the estimate of $30 to $35 per shipment, sending it to me to Switzerland. What my US helps me with is I send all my packages to them. So let's say three orders. Most of them provide shipped within America, free shipment or minimum shipment of maybe three to four dollars. I take the slowest shipment, so no priority. And once all of my um, uh, parcels arrived, I then go into the dashboard of my US and I tell them to package it and ship it to, to Switzerland. Now, I use the premium account. I don't use the single um, package um, um, version, which is free. So I use the, um, the premium one. Why? Because it offers me a free package storage for 30 days. So some parcels maybe arrive after 
five days, some of the 10, maybe even 20 days. I've never had it, but let's say uh, it arrives only after 20 days. So for 30 days, it doesn't cost you any storage to keep all of these parcels together. Once you've received all of your parcels, um, you can then say, repackage everything into one box and not multiple boxes or multiple fees that you have to pay. They just package everything together. They give you the weight of all the items because they weigh all the items as they come in. They take photos of all the items as they come in. And um, then you can just ship it to your address. In my case, I'll ship it to Switzerland. But what is very interesting, remember, the UK shop is working. If we go on this information here, you also have in the United Kingdom a address, so a delivery address where you can get things shipped. And I was just thinking tonight, maybe a reverse of this will work. So meaning you are not buying in America, but you're getting shipped to the United Kingdom. So for instance, you buy from Mellow 3D, you put in your UK um, virtual address in, so your virtual postal address as a delivery address. Your All your parcels that you order arrive at your My US account in the United Kingdom. Once that has arrived, you can then ship it off to America because your delivery address is in America. Yes, it will come with additional fees. You will have way longer waiting periods. But for me, if I was living in America, this would be the workaround that I would be testing and trying out if this is working so that at least I can buy product to finish my project. Because if you plan to use the mammoth all-wheel drive um, gantry, um, Goliath, hot end, hextruder, all of these products you can't buy at the moment, so you can't finish your project. And this is definitely a way forward, I think, to get products in America. We don't know what the input taxes are if products are coming from the UK. But what I can tell you as an insider tip, my US, so coming from United Kingdom, they just say this is a metal item or this is a 3D printed item. They don't state from which country it is actually from. So maybe it will help. I would say definitely worth testing to get any of the products that you need for your projects to finish your project. That's about it. That's all that I wanted to share with you. Um, please leave comments below if this was helpful. Um, also, I would be interesting if you are willing to test this. Um, if I do test this because I have a friend in America that needs parts, maybe we should test it with a not so expensive item to see if it would uh, get through all the way to America, how long it will take. And I will give feedback uh, in the comments below um, once we've done it or we've, we've reached um, the goal of getting it into America via the United Kingdom. But yeah, please let me know what you think. And uh, thanks for watching and we'll see us in the next video.